log 5. Hello 2024 and welcome back to Rolling with the Punches. We're starting off strong with an amazing workout. Make sure you get yours too. Now we're headed to Vice City to go see my sister perform at the NXT WWE Center. Roxanne's about to perform. She's so cute. She bumps off the bottom ropes. <laughs> but my sister's Lola Vice. She currently has the breakout in NXT and she could use it at any moment to cash in for the championship. I look like I'm working the apron when I watch her, so don't mind me. There goes Lola pushing her off the ropes, getting ready for a chokehold. That was not a sound effect. Let's be honest, Lola has the most technical striking in WWE, period. Look at how she controls her power and her kicks. It allows her to aim precisely. There she goes. She's my favorite wrestler in WWE, and she is a true Latina superhero. Now that Lola has the breakout, what do you think she's going to do regarding her contract? Part of my New Year's resolution is to grow rolling with the punches and bring y'all with me everywhere. I'm hoping to get a tryout soon. Shh. In just a little bit, my sister and I will be on our way to go see Harry Potter to fight some Dementors. To the same! Oh my gosh. I was a little girl. Nobody in my family has ever let me get anything from Cinnabon. And they tell me on the way back, on the way back. My sister just told me on the way back we could get Cinnabon. That means we're not getting it. I'm gonna get it on the way back for real though. I got my Cinnabon. A Velocicoaster and we thought that we ate, right? By doing single rider and skipping the line. Turns out the people that were in the regular line went on before us. And Francesca and I got separated last minute. And right before I go, the kid that I was going with was like, Tengo miedo. A little kid that was randomly next to me because I was a single rider. Spider-Man is my favorite Marvel character. I've been going to these parks since I was a little girl and I never get tired of the same rides. Sometimes what I do is that I'll watch the movies before I come to the park to refresh my memory. I would always come to the parks as a kid, so it just reminds me of my dad so much. His favorite ride was E.T., so of course, we have to go on E.T., and Valerie and I feel like it's shutting down. E.T. was supposed to say our names, but I think he forgot. <laughs> but tomorrow's Sunday football. I'm going to watch with my friend Asoko. One thing about me, I love vegan farmer's markets. I was the happiest woman in the world here, but then it started raining, so I had to run. One of my fans tagged me on Instagram that my package aired on Spectrum Sports News, but I didn't even know myself, so I was so happy. Go check it out on my Instagram. Here's a little clip into your life. She moved to Orlando to go to UCF in the passion of all. First Taekwondo and now fighting. When I say fighter, yeah. no one believes me. When I get out in the cage, that's when I prove myself. But not in the fight inside. I have always wanted to be a superhero. As long as you're a superhero, undercover and nobody needs to know it the good stuff natalie's goal to become her own superhero for other girls to look up to i'm headed to the grand canyon state i know i jump a lot side note i'm a dolphins fan i just had to say that but my boyfriend surprised me with tickets to a cardinals 49ers game so i needed an outfit so i made my way to miami guita sarita just kidding sara I will clip in a little photo of the final outfit. But I'm so excited, I love football. When Purdy came back in the game, I asked him for a Diet Coke and pulled an Andy Anderson. There's a pic of us and our final outfits and the 49ers won, baby. As I'm editing this, I don't even know where I'm going right I now. think I was going back home. Now from Miami, we're surprising my mom with a trip to Nashville. See you next week in Nashville. Yeah!